Hey, welcome back to Arrow Slinging TV. Today I'm gonna to talk a little bit about my new arrow shafts and what I'm doing. Here's one of my PVC tubes that I make for practice. Hold six arrows with a belt. Cute, huh? This is my new gig, guys. White arrow shafts. Come on. This is what I'm talking about. Why have I gone to white? I saw a video of Guy Fitzgerald up north. He was talking about paint narrow shafts and it kind of got my attention. And what am I doing with it? Well, look, I noticed that sh shoot, I shoot instinctive. I thought that I didn't really use the arrow shaft for a reference. I don't really, but I always notice the arrow in my peripheral vision and that does weigh into the way I shoot instinctively. Well, I noticed when I had these Ted Nugent arrows that were white and black striped that I, I shot a little bit better. So I thought, well, let me paint an arrow white and see if it helped. Just been able to locate that, my, locate that arrow in my peripheral vision when I'm shooting at the target. And I, and I shoot instinctive. I look at what I want to see, what I want to hit, and that's what I focus on. But with that black arrow just kind of disappeared. And let me tell you the problem instinctive off of a say like my Bob Lee no problem right because that arrow sits right on my hand so wherever my hand is it's kind of like I'm pointing so I could turn my bow sideways it doesn't matter I instinctively know wherever my hand is that's where the arrow is I don't have to know where the arrow is the problem with shooting compound instinctive the arrow doesn't sit on top of your hand the arrow sits on top of this drop away which is like almost an inch, inch and a half from the top of my hand. Okay, so check it out. That drop away is like an inch, inch and a half higher than my hand. So this is where the problem comes in. With a regular bow, that arrow's right on top of my hand with a traditional recurve or longbow. Now it's much higher, so not having any idea where that arrow is when I'm shooting was starting to affect my shooting shooting instinctively with a compound. So now, just been able to locate it in my peripheral vision, that white arrow, it's, it's an ivory paint, has helped my shooting out tremendously. I just went to Walmart. Uh, Guy Fitzgerald told me to uh, sand it, the shaft down just a tad, and I did that. I went to Walmart and I got an ivory white paint, and uh, I just did a tack coat, and then I came back with a couple more coats. And I use the ivory white so it's not glaring white. It doesn't have a sheen to it so it doesn't catch a, a deer's eye or something in the stand. But with the ivory, it's dull but it's still white and I can catch it in my peripheral. So just a little tip for you. I don't know if it'll help you with your instinctive compound shooting, but if it does, fantastic. Don't forget to subscribe and uh, comment below. What do you use? Have you ever painted an arrow shaft before? If so, let us know.